Hi, my name's Courtney, I'm one of the reps here in the iForge. Today I'm going to take you through some of our heated tools. So, we've got three heated tools in the iForge at the moment. Uh, we have a glue gun here, we have a hot wire cutter, and we have a soldering iron. Um, if you don't know where any of them are, please just ask our reps and they'll be able to direct you to where they're all stored. Um, so, as is in the name, they're all hot. So the main risk with, with most of them is just burning yourself with them. So I'm going to talk you through some of the steps we can take to make sure that you don't hurt yourself whilst using them. So, here we have our glue gun. Um, the tip is the bit that gets very hot, there's a heating element in here. Um, just make sure that you use a piece of scrap wood when you are uh, when you're using it, just ensure you don't leave hot glue all over the desks. Um, keep the, the space clean as well as safe. Uh, next we have our hot wire cutter here. It basically heats up this piece of wire and it's used to cut foam on. Um, these wires can break really easily, so if you see it deflecting a huge amount, then please just slow down the rate that you're pushing it through the, uh, through the device. If uh, it does break, please speak to one of our reps, they'll be able to show you and then once they've shown you, you'll be able to replace it next time once you're happy doing that. Um, with all of these, please wait till they are cold before you put them away, so we reduce the risk of fire. Um, and please again, like, don't touch the heating elements or the ends while they're still hot, um, as you will, you will burn yourself. So the last of our three uh, heated tools is the soldering iron that we have here. So these soldering irons are really great because they have this latching mechanism on them. So when you put the soldering iron back down, they'll actually switch off by themselves. But just make sure that you never leave a soldering iron on the table as it's, in a, it's a big fire risk in the, in the lab. So a couple of other things is obviously this is an incredibly hot tool. So never, never get your hands in the way. Always keep your hands directly out of the way and use things to clamp your piece if you need to do soldering that is, is quite intricate. Also, after you stop using it, please don't scrape off the solder off the end of it. If you do, then uh, the tip will oxidise and, and it will stop working and we have to buy new tips. Um, you, there's always, there's always some, uh, some, wire, some metal wire in there, so you can just brush it off lightly on it um, and just leave a, leave a coating on the top. So as I said, some of the main risks are involved with heat with this. Um, another thing is just to make sure, these are heat proof wires, but just try and make sure you don't touch the wire with the soldering iron because it can lead to electrocution and we really don't want that. Thanks for listening to this video on all of our heated tools that we have in the iForge. We really appreciate you taking the time to listen to these videos and being aware of some of the risks that are imposed with using these. Um, so thanks for listening.